Hello, I'm back, uh, and I'm quite excited to be playing a game where hopefully I won't have to think so much and just dick around and let it happen. Because um, very stressful doing all that puzzle, taking notes. I'm really counting on not having to take notes on this one. So this is Windstorm and Unexpected Arrival, also known as Windstorm Ari's Arrival in some territories, which is the name of the film it's based on. I think it's German, but I forgot to check that. Uh, oh yeah, it's because it's called, I think it's called Ostfint in other versions. So this is a sequel to a game that I have played sometime last year. Uh, but only did a couple of hours on because it wasn't very good. But reviews suggest that this is much improved. Um, still not overwhelmingly great reviews, but um, hopefully there'll be a bit more to it. Actual Mika. Windstorm, get somewhere safe, please. It's dangerous. <coughs> Run. Run away. Wind. Storm. Windstorm, get somewhere safe, please. I feel like a horse escaping from a fire feels like a very classic intro. I don't know if that's just because I played the intro to Pets Horses 2 twice, but I feel like I've seen it in plenty of other games too. Yeah. It's just jumping automatically here by the way. I can't take credit for pressing spacebar correctly at this stage. I think I just have look controls, so I'm not actually that chucked into it. So, I believe I played as Miko in the last game, but in this one, I think I will be Ari. Wow, calm down, are you crazy? The blinking's really unsettling. I presume it's meant to make the characters feel more human, but. Wow. Well, I find it I? very unpleasant. <laughs> you are still with me in the car, an hour now. We're in a car. Good to be established. Going. By the way, your latest foster parents were about to call the police after you almost broke their son's nose. Harry's a badass. Or not that much of a badass. How do you expect to ever find a family if you keep doing this? <laughs> Don't give me that look. I know you didn't mean it that way. I didn't want to punch him. He didn't give me any other choice. Ari, you always have a choice. You have to control yourself. You are ruining your future with this. Just promise me that you are a bit more relaxed this time. I am risking a lot with this. <laughs> I like the fanny is constantly rolling her eyes. Um. And yeah, I think fanny would have to be an adult. I mean, but presumably not an actual guardian if she's all talking about foster fans. So I guess maybe she works for the agency or something. Oh god, she's not always rolling her eyes. Sometimes she's doing an insane grin. Ari? Ari? Are, are you crazy? Okay, so that happened inside the car, I guess? Okay. Interesting belt usage. I might try that out. Sort of over the right hand side of the shirt and the t shirt, but kind of presumably the belt goes under there and that's just the belt flap there. That is, yeah, gonna have fun with that. Uh, obviously, I'm gonna go back here and look at this car and try and jump over this fence, which I definitely can't. I did happen to see on the Steam community page someone had done instructions for how to remove the motion blur. Which I can see why that's a popular post. Uh, it involves editing in any file, so I think we're gonna live with it for this week. But I'm not like a fast pot on graphics, but that is a bit much. She was very kind. 
mind. I feel bad for her, but I am not going to another foster family. <laughs> so I think I'm... Am I meant to be legging it? Like a mad lad. The car has left. Is there a run? No, I think I've just got chum, haven't I? I saw an airport sign on the way here. Fiji sounds nice. Let's see if we've got any options. Oh, nice. Reset to campfire. It's a proper open world game. You'll notice there a uh, bow and arrow. I'm very excited about that. Um, <gasps> side missions and repeatable missions. Good types of mission. Um, I do have the map. Wasn't sure if I'd not have this unlocked yet. So I believe, Giselle, that yes, we are running from Fanny, um, but in a very low stakes way where Fanny isn't chasing. But that's the implication from the, no, what are you doing? There's question marks. Oh, Marie's going to be thrilled about this. There's an archery shooting range, which is probably what my bow and arrow is for, rather than hunting and skinning animals to make pouches to hold more ammo. So I wonder if this is... Because the previous game was set on the ranch, but I, the, I can't remember if it didn't have open roam or not. I think it did. It's got achievements! Are they achievements? Oh, maybe not really that. They're just an extra type of quest. Uh, okay. I currently can't press triangle to steal that tractor. Maybe later. And I don't know if I have a bow and arrow yet to fuck up this uh, scarecrow. Nice scarecrow. What if this other family would have been nice to me? It's um, very waypoint followy, isn't it? Like it's not even enticing me to get to there. But I'm fine with that. I like linear games, so I don't object. Stretching uh, the grass, that's not bad. I mean, it's not doing proper, obviously, like Red Dead style tramples, but it's decent grass. I mean, it's obviously sort of. It's not fair to compa compare it to Ghost of Tsushima. That uh, was a much more expensive game. Such good grass, though. Oh, hello, big guy. What are you doing here all alone? Is that like a weird earring? What's the horse? <gasps> yes. <laughs> oh, this is Windstorm. Don't nice dialogue. Afraid. I won't hurt you. Just blinks all round. Hey, little girl, what are you doing here? Did you want an autograph from Windstorm? Windstorm? The famous Windstorm, pride of the Caldenbark Ranch. Had never heard of him? He... he looks unhappy. Uh, unhappy is putting it lightly. The poor animal is going through a, a rough patch. A fire burned his home down. His best friend Mika <sighs> is in a coma. His son... Mika's in a coma? In North America. His mare... is... Uh, yeah. I'm sorry. He will have a hard time getting back on his feet. The uh, hooves. I... I know this might sound weird, but... I dreamt of him. Well, Windstorm is a famous horse. Many young people dream of him. No. Not like that. I didn't even know about him until now. You mentioned a fire? I dreamt how he, how Windstorm saves a young girl with red hair to protect her from a raging forest fire. A young girl, you say? Huh, that is strange. Are you sure you didn't see that in the news? Just want to take a quick moment to compliment this game for having that skip cutscene uh, option there. You know, normally when it's a dialogue based, press A to advance. You have to press A a whole bunch of times to get through it. I'm uh, I'm not going to use it, obviously. I'm here for the story, primarily. But I'm impressed that they put it in there. Yes, very sure. <laughs> also, having a demon on a horse just yes, saying nothing, because he's a horse. Can I pet him? Mm, I fear that won't be this easy. 
Not only does Windstorm need affection and care, he also needs a very strong and dominant hand right now to give him security. Baldach. Excuse me? Bald axe? Baldach, the warrior. Grandpa? That's Are not Baldach. Fanny's mad as hell. An orphan she was supposed to take care of jumped out of her car. And we have to go out and find... <laughs> I've interrupted to stare at him. Let me guess. Ari. Yep. Okay, so Fanny's known. So Fanny must have been in the previous game. I think, did we have Sam in the previous one and spent a while trying to work out if he was a love interest or a brother or both? And I can't remember what the answer was. And that is short for... Ari. Okay. Yeah, you deserve that. I see. Well, Fanny needs you at the ranch, and she's mad as hell. What were you thinking? Uh, don't worry, Sam. She was just keeping me and Windstorm company. No harm done. Oh, Neptune. Yeah, you're right. Uh, it does still say I'm playing Blackmore Manor because I think I typed in all the new things and then p forgot to click the update button in OBS because uh, I'm not very good at this. I mean, I'm going to click it now, but it's probably too late because I've started the stream. Um, so... This game is Windstorm, Ari's Arrival, or Windstorm, an unexpected arrival, depending on um, what version it is. This version is called an unexpected arrival. Well, I don't know where you would get it so. called Ari's Arrival. In any case, I have to take her to the ranch now. She's Fanny's problem then. So it seems like I've done quite a shit job of ditching Fanny. Here we are, Kaltenbach Ranch. Oh no, not now. Don't leave me hanging. <laughs> he has a weird face. Sorry, Fanny. <coughs> it's over. Engine died. Anyways, I found Ari with my grandfather in Windstorm. They've just set up a reason I can't press triangle to steal that tractor, haven't they? Fuckers. The poor tractor. A new tractor was long overdue. We need something that represents the ranch a bit better. Y yeah, yes, of course, Isabel. I also don't want to see you run around like a stable boy anymore. Don't you agree, Say? Y yes, Isabel. Say. I it's Sam, by the way. Who's called Say? So I think she's the bad guy, right? Like upper self horse girl, classic. You should take better care of him, Fenella. He might not <laughs> only need a new tractor. Is Fenella a real name or just a joke extension of Fanny? I don't think I've heard it before, but then what is Fanny short for? Why don't you get yourself a new job, you snake? <laughs> oh, I will, Fenella. I will. I guess um, I'll try and keep an eye on myself. If anyone else can keep an eye, see if any characters aren't blinking, so we can you. just check for Cylons and that. Wow. What were you thinking, jumping out of my car like that? Back to the eye roll. I am sorry. I didn't mean to cause trouble. I was scared. You can't buy anything from an apology. Otherwise, <laughs> you'd be a gold mine for child protective services. Again, you are quite something. You know that? Anyway, I'll introduce you to the others. This is Sam. I am Sam. Can I call him Se the whole time? I would quite like to do that. Very funny. He works here as the stable boy. Takes care of the horse droppings. He sleeps in the hay. He is the grandson of the great Mr. Khan, who you already met. So, I... If he's not Mika's love interest, then he probably is going to be mine. It's been set up as, like, you know, man of the people and that. Hi, Sam. seems to like him. Doing weird smiles. The blonde snake over there is Isabel. She works here as an intern for the private horse management sector, or something like that. She thinks she's a big deal around here. Okay, I am, uh, 
I'm into the private horse management sector as my bad guy organization. I heard that, Fenella. Hello, Isabel. I am Ari. <laughs> <laughs> then, the great grandmother and owner of the ranch, the one and only Maria Kaltenbach. Without her, this whole place would fall apart. Welcome, Ari. I think we'll get along just nicely. As long as you do your part here at the ranch. Yeah, I'm going to be doing all the Charlie work. She is very tough. However, she is not... Oh no, because he does the shit picking. That's already been confirmed, hasn't it? Well, enough to see you're not working, Samuel. To the stable with you. I need Ecuador and Autumn ready... Ecuador! Dee, 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 dee. Ecuador is my favourite horse so far. Of, of course, Mrs. Kaltenbach. Mrs. Kaltenbach, have you already taken your medicine today? Thank you, Isabel. What would I do without you? And here we have... Tinka! I am here from time to time as a stable girl. Hey there, Tinka! Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, Ari. Ah, Ari. If you have time, could you lend me a hand? It's the least you can do to repay me for my... taxi service. Fanny will take care of your stuff and get your room ready. Looks like I'm going to be doing some of the shit picking for him. And yeah, possibly hoof cleaning. Um, so, you know, you can probably infer it from the on-screen prompts. I'm playing this with a controller. The Steam listing says um, controllers only no keyboard support, but actually it does have complete keyboard support. But if I can play it on controller and controller's lead, I'm going to go for it. But I've never done hoof picking with a with a controller before, so maybe it'll be uh, more fun for me at least. Care before the clients come. We have to get them both ready. Go to the well and bring me a bucket of water. Hey, look, his hair looks quite different. Yeah, I'm fine with that. You can't miss it. It's right around the corner. There's loads of corners. We'll do, Sam. Objectives. Nice little strutty walk. Okay, so running is just pushing the stick all the way. Is that an item? Yeah. Oh no, it just happened to show me the prompt about to pick up a bucket as I walked up to the radio. Oh, I was really excited to be able to prompt that radio. Sad dog. Fuck your bucket. I've got a dog to interact with. Yes! Ah! <gasps> I can pet the dog! Best game ever, 10 out of 10. And that was just, was that my general animal trust bar went up? Yeah. I've got some trust with animals to help with my abilities of the warrior. <gasps> There's a cat! <laughs> the cat's weirder than the dog. Still totally worth it. I didn't actually pet the horse in the end, did I? Can I pet the car? I can't pet the car. And I can't rob the car. I mean, I kind of knew both those things anyway. But I had to make sure. Uh, got distracted. Right. He said round the corner, right? I'm going to try and open this door, but I'm pretty sure it's round the other side of this building. Yep. I thought I saw a prompt somewhere. <gasps> do puzzle? I'll do the puzzles. Oh well. Maybe another time for the puzzles. I'm taking a bad route. Oh no, it's fine. Oh, that's an annoying thing I don't like. Like if you don't, so it's, you know, left stick to move, right stick to look. And if you sort of leave it looking sideways for a, a bit too long, it sort of... Oh no, it was only while I was running. It sort of goes back into looking where you're going. I guess it's a fairly standard thing, but it felt a bit too... Oh, hello! You need petting! Okay, this is a pretty good mini game of finding and petting all the animals. I am very popular.
So this suggests there are 10 animals to pet in total, right? And then I guess a bunch of people to pet. Um, I mean, presumably they'll be spread around. Just want to try and pet this horse before I go and do anything else. Yeah, I can pet the horse! Is that, that's just the same dog that's moved, isn't it? No! Different dog! I was expecting them to be more spread around. But it seems like I've got most of them... Presumably this is the dog you'd said I'd miss, Giselle. Um, let me know if there's another one I somehow missed. But yeah, I was expecting them to be more spread around, like, the whole massive map. But I guess if they're, like, domestic animals, they are going to be hanging around the actual bit where people live, aren't they? Uh I should get back on my mission. I'll find the other animals. Oh, but I could pet this horse. What if I can pet this horse and that horse? Oh, God. It's a nice wig. Okay, there's another horse out there, which I'm going to go and pet now. Hey! I didn't get any bonus points for that one. Fuck this horse. Imposter? Not real horse? Somehow the same horse as the one I stroke? It's got the same weird wig. Right, my mission. Can do some petting later. You're a good boy. So I say I'm concentrating on my main mission, I am still looking around for animals. I mean, I walked right past this. I should have picked this up and then the took it with me to do all the other petting. Yeah. I should have known. It's heavy. Yay. Infinite magic bag of carrying. Vince. Here you go, buddy. All right, now for the finishing touch. Get me the saddles. You'll find them outside of the exhibition area. Please. On my way, sir. Nice. Can just go through the bushes. That's good. Oh, who's this? He looks like a bad guy. I thought they would be here. Strange. Or at least a man from an indie band. Or both. Huh? <laughs> you weren't introduced before. Who are you? Me. I just arrived here. If you haven't heard of me, then I wonder what you're doing in this business at all. Okay, he does blink, so he's not a robot. Or a good robot. Thorder Thorvaldson, Star Horse Trainer. Have you seen any saddles lying around here, Mr. Thorvaldson? Saddles? This is a disaster. Lying around somewhere? No wonder this place is losing its reputation by the minute. No, I have not. Now scram! I found a scary cat man, but no saddles. Maybe I'm looking in the wrong place. It's a cat man. I mean, that means I should pet him. I can't pet the man. This looks like somewhere I'm going to dressage around, doesn't it? Although there is a thing in the middle of it, so maybe not. Actually, no, we described it as the competition area, so. More horses, can I pet them? Can I hop this fence? I mean, the answer's clearly no, but I'm going to try with a run up. No. Nope. Just going to smash my shins. Oh, hello! Yep, that'll do, close enough. OK, 
cat is comprehensively petted. Mm -hmm. What's he going to do? Oh, I went to go and pet that horse, but actually, I guess I may as well speak to Tinker, who I'm actually supposed to be speaking Tinker. to anyway. Oh yes, you mean Ecuador and Autumn. They're right here. Thanks. Sam needs them. If you were done fooling around with Excuse me, I'm not fooling around with Sam. How Mr. dare you? Khan is bringing Windstorm to the ranch. Windstorm is coming? Oh yes, I will be there as soon as I get Sam the saddles. Okay, but can I pet anything first? Ah, oh, it's a fuzzy horse. There's some more horses. Do you reckon they need petting? Can't hurt, can it? Hey, buddies! Interesting. Maybe only certain horses are worth the effort. Like, I'm obviously going to pet this other one as well, but I feel like it's not going to give me any XP. Oh no, it is! <gasps> I think I've got to do one more good petting left, and I'll unlock some kind of warrior skill. It's exciting. What do you reckon I'll get? Nope, come on. I'll find out levels later. I also wonder if there's going to be a level 2, because it just feels like it's been too easy for me to get most of them. I've not really explored that hard, and I'm not particularly good at spotting stuff. Ah, oh, it's gone further away, the knobber. Uh, Katie, for whistling and shit shoveling, it's been suggested that I need to help Sam with chores, which I think I'm about to do. Oh, he's got gloves on. That means horse bark time, doesn't it? Um, I've mostly been being distracted by petting animals, but I think I'm about to do some horse care. Two saddles for a uh, quad court and blossom? This joke isn't working for me. Those names aren't that hard to remember. Ecuador and Autumn. Thanks, Ari. Sam, come quick! Something has happened! Fanny? What is going on? Maria, she's not feeling well. She fell over. We called an ambulance. Mrs. Kaltenbach? Are you alright? She just fell over while we had a quick lunch break. I'm feeling good about the fact that she fell over rather than had a fall, right? Because that would be worse. Um, but now I think Isabel pushed her, pushed her over, obviously. I am fine. <coughs> I am fine. Stop looking at me like that. Maria, I told you not to overdo it. You said I will be fine if I take the medicine you gave me for crying out loud. I said it might get better. I'm a veterinarian for crying out loud. You need a proper doctor and properly prescribed medication. <laughs> Did he give her horse pills? Excuses, excuses, my dear Andreas. Mrs. Kaltenbach, they are going to take you to the nearest hospital. And afterwards, to the Health and Rehabilitation Center, as discussed. And then what? I take vacation? What about the open house? The ranch? What about... <sighs> You're right. I might need a rest. Well, not a rest. Maybe... Maybe I need a replacement. But Mika is not here at the moment. Not Mika. She doesn't have what it takes. I am talking Harsh. about Isabel Herberg, of course. Ooh, good question, Ray. It seems likely that Maria would have been in the fire, but they haven't explicitly mentioned it here. E excuse me? She has what it takes. The discipline, the knowledge. I also think that she is the best fit for the job. <laughs> She will take over full responsibility of the ranch. Temporary, of course, and then 
after I return from my vacation. But she is blinking, so probably not an evil robot, Maria. We will measure her by her skills and see if she can do it. Mrs. Kaltenbach, I don't know what to say. Thank you for all the trust. You are going to do a great job, Isabel. I am sure of it. <sighs> what a disaster. Poor Mrs. Kaltenbach. Told her not to overdo it. Say, do you have a moment? There are some important business matters to discuss. As I am now in charge of the ranch, I need a strong right-hand man helping me out around here. Y yes, Isabel. Uh, Ari, is it okay? It looks I like I'm doing old Charlie work with no instruction. It's okay. Tinka asked me to join her and your grandfather. Oh no, it's like still no horse care yet. Try and tinker, but also take a weird route in case I find that tenth animal to pet. Um, I'm going to go and try and climb that tower. You, you understand? Because if I get access to a bow and arrow, I want to know if I can get some good uh, sniper points. No, no, just clip through the ladder. I mean, that's a surprise to no one, but I had to check. Oh, I haven't tried jumping at the ladder. Also won't work, but... Use Sheriff Badger on ladder. Haven't got a button for that. I don't think I've got a run button. If I'm just going to double check. Those are all horse controls. But no, I don't think there was ever going to be a run button. Oh, no. Okay, interesting. It's not a super magic barrier. So if I get the right bit of fence, I can do it. I think the horror film, Giselle, is just the weirdness of the people. Like I say, I think blinking people is much... Like blink, blinking cartoon stills is much creepier than pure still ones. And then some of the weird still weird ways they talk... And then I guess the literal fact that someone's had a mysterious fall. I'm not sure I've actually pet Windstorm yet. And the gas for permission, they didn't get to do it, so there we go. Tinka, ah! Windstorm. Good to see you it's all. good to see you, but mostly Windstorm. I want to get my petting points. <sighs> He's chatting to me now. We're friends. Ari, how are you? You seem to have settled in well. I brought Windstorm because one of the new trainers wanted to see him. New trainer? That must be, uh, that Thor guy. Thorder. Thor... Thorder? Thorder Thorvaldson? Yes, that was it. Do you know him? More than just no. We go way back. Oh, Windstorm, I hope they know what they're doing. Is something wrong? No, uh, well, yes. I'm not sure if that new trainer is what Windstorm really needs at the moment. Hmm, Ari, what do you think of taking Windstorm out for a ride? Quite actually, the petting first, but sure. What? Really? What? Windstorm? Yes, uh, I do have a good feeling. Just hop on him and use all your senses. Just relax and try to feel his inner voice. Tinker can accompany you for a ride around the ranch. Actually, that music's quite horror-y as well, isn't it, Giselle? Um, has has Ari actually said at any point that she can ride horses or has an interest in it? Or we just kind of assumed it? Okay, I'm going to... Thanks for the suggestion with the mounting, which I'm looking forward to seeing that jump. Looks cool. Jumping is cool. We know that. Um, but I'm going to try and pet him first. Oh. oh. So maybe important horses don't count because they're too big a deal. Like, obviously I'm going to pet Windstorm. Whereas I've got to be fucking around with some misc animals. 
Can I pet these guys? Nope, nope, nope. Let's get on the horse. Let's do as I'm supposed to. Okay, so it's like tap A to accelerate. I don't actually have to hold it, I was unclear. What is your route? What is what are you doing, Tinker? Oh god, I looked away for a second and I absolutely lo Oh, hold on, I've got a mini map for this reason. Sorry pal, we're with you in a sec. Yeah, about those notifications. And I think my update, I also wrote a new go live notification, so that should be fixed when I start the next one next week as well, as of that update, because I am indeed playing an actual horse game now. I could be wrong, but I feel like this is not taking the best route anywhere. I did just happen to see this as a complaint and a review about this whole follow mechanic being just a lot less good than just being told the waypoint that you're going to. To meet there. Um, especially if there's nothing happening during the follow. You know, like in, in Red Dead or something, you would be having chat during this. Also, you'd have to go like four times as far because that map is massive. Um, but this just feels like a very inefficient way of getting to my next wait. Where are you? I'm quite scared of overtaking her because someone said that if you accidentally overtake your follow person, that messes stuff up. So maybe I've done that and I've gone past some kind of trigger points. This is um, this doesn't feel like an oh, I was gonna say this doesn't feel like a natural casual ride, and that confirms it. Quite impressive. You do have a lot of talent, Ari. Uh, yeah, you're right, Bromans. There is a big motion blur on this, um, which I intend to fix before next week's stream, but it looks like it involves, like, fucking around with any files rather than just the easy configurable options in-game, so let's stick it out. Did you just ride Windstorm? Just like that? She has it in her blood. Just like Mika. You hear that? I'm just like Mika. Yeah, just like Mika. That's just crazy. Who is Mika? I've heard who is Mika? How dare you? Mika was the only person who could ride Windstorm. It was crazy. She was able to do it from the moment she arrived. She is a bit like you. Sadly, she is in a coma now. She visited Windstorm in Andalusia when a wildfire broke out. We brought them both back to Germany for treatment. Oh, okay, so Maria probably wasn't in the fire. I guess? Mm, poor girl. She's also one of the reasons why Windstorm is not feeling so well. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to talk to Isabel Herberg about an apparent urgent matter. Ooh, parkour! Ari, would you mind if we let you run through a parkour around the ranch? I'll do a parkour around the ranch. You mean the parkour for the open house? The test course, at least. What do you say, Ari? Are you with us? Do I have an of option course. here? Ah, oh, no. So Seemed unlikely. Fun. This ain't horses, too. Are still rough around the edges? So, no responsibility for broken bones and things. I might break some bones. We'll find out how good the um, fucking up animations are, can't we? Okay, so if you press the jump button standing still, you rear up, that's good. Seems appropriate. Faster? This is already fast. And let's try not jumping. Okay, so the horse jumps anyway, even if you don't do anything. 
I'm guessing you do a better faster jump. If you actually do your timing right. This is good news for someone who's bad at jumping while on a stream. Ah, so it says good jump if you do a good jump. That is the sort of reward I'm into. Yeah, fuck. Tried to do a good jump and I didn't. <gasps> is wonderful better than good jump? Or is it just pulled from a list to keep things interesting? Wonderful's probably better and I just, I've just got good. You did Parkour! Well, Say, what is going on? That is our most valuable property. It doesn't belong in a child's hands, especially not hers. Isabel, you gotta see this. She was riding Windstorm like it was nothing. It is a jumping horse, Say. It's in his instincts to carry the rider. She did nothing to contribute. It was dangerous and reckless for her and the ranch. She's accidentally called uh, Windstorm his, in one sense there. But, but... Enough. You heard the manager. The horse will now be specially trained. Everyone back to work. Windstorm is coming with me. Bye-bye, Thordor. What do you have in mind? <laughs> oh. No, no. He is scared. I can feel it. Don't trust him. Ari, it's fine. Get off the horse. No. <gasps> no. Sam, Kick it off. Please. Get off that horse, girl. Right now. Get down there. Will you hold still now? Damn, what dick? Ooh, steam achievement. Don't even think about that. You'll stay here and think about what you've done. To protect him, please. Ari, we need to protect everyone from you. Are you even listening? Whoa, to yourself? now. I'm trying to convince everyone that you were not crazy and you were just lashing out. I had to call Child Protective Services, and Isabel almost called the police on you. You didn't leave us much choice, Ari. This was doomed to failure from the very. Whoa, have I done something really bad off screen? <laughs> Mrs. Kaltenbach has a serious heart condition, and Isabel is now in charge. She knows what's the right thing to do for the farm, Windstorm, and Mika. No, she wants everything. She wants Kaltenbach, and you are her stupid janitor. Stupid I've janitor. Seen someone as obsessed with power as Isabel. And how was Isabel supposed to help Mika? Mika and Windstorm, my grandfather told me that they have a deeper connection. Oh, so you believe that? But not that Isabel wants to take over the whole business here. Even if, maybe she is doing the right thing. Sometimes you are a real idiot. I'm leaving. Sam! We have to! Ari, you screwed up, okay? You can't stay here anymore. You will go somewhere where you are better oh, wow. than here, and where you can't ruin everything. Have I disrespected some produce? Leave it be, all right? You are 13. What do you understand? Sam! Please don't be blind! I... Stop it, Ari. I've had enough. I've had enough of all of this. And enough of you. Oh, fuck this guy. <laughs> Ari? Come back immediately. Ari? Ari! Didn't he just tell me to fuck off? Am I running away again? Yeah? Wait, but I might need to pet some stuff before I go. I think I'll probably be back here for this um, one map full of stuff. Well, I mean, something shady is up here. Why do both of their cars have the same number plate? And that one's the same one again. This is... That's some dodgy shit. Oh! Fire! Who would have thought a legend like you is scared of some tiny flames? 
Yes, I control the flames, not you. Give in to your fear. I can help you. Fuck him up, Windstorm. You are a stubborn one, aren't you? But not for long. You will. Windstorm? What? Oh, it's you. Let him go. He must understand that I am in control of his fears. This is inhumane. Stop it once. You force your respect on him with all means and lose his trust. This can't work. Please, he's scared. <laughs> you are so naive, little brat. Go ask the great Khan, Sam's grandfather. Khan! Technique years ago, and it's still a solid method. Why don't you relax and watch? Forget it, you maniac! Now do I get my bow and arrow? You better watch out, girl. Or you'll be in the biggest trouble of your life. I didn't see you coming last time, but this time I am prepared. You wouldn't want your fingers to get burned now, would you? Let him go! This is your last warning! Naive little piece of- Oh! <laughs> I warned you! Yay! I'm gonna take you down, I swear! She's it! Don't even think about leaving the ranch. I swear, we will catch you and the horse. You hear me? Steel horse! Yay, more motion blur. Windstorm, stay calm. I'm with you. Don't be scared, please. You can do it. All right? Oh, no. Oh, no, I've got caught on a thing. That's real bad. That's quite a short timer. Okay, maybe a longer sprint bar is a thing I can unlock by petting all the cats and dogs. Yeah, again with the um, very like short-term objectives. But then, to be fair, I wouldn't want to have to stop and look at the map where I'm actually going. But also, I don't trust this game to give me direct routes after that weird fucking circle of... Shit, is that someone chasing me? <gasps> no! Same number plate again on these dodgy fucks. Nice. I mean, it's telling me to go down the river, so I'm going down the river. It feels like it's a lot slower than not staying in the river. But what do I know? I'm 13. Oh, there's a question mark! Am I going to get Skyrim distracted? Not with a 30 second timer. But I really want to get Skyrim distracted. I've done bad jumping. Okay, there is a button for reverse. Uh, it definitely made a point of there being a button for reverse. And I thought it was RB, but that doesn't seem to have done anything. Let's hope that... I mean, it seems... Oh, I don't think it's even cumulative, it just hits 30 seconds every time you hit a new one. I thought it was adding a few seconds every time, but no, this is actually fine. I can get away with being quite shit, which is, you know, handy. Can't I see the jump better this time? Yeah, well done, me. Search lights. Shit. Oh, yeah, I am steering that way. Steering. <sighs> Why don't I get to get, do the cool car jumps? I guess because I'd fuck them up and have to redo them. Heads up! Branch is incoming. Uh, ouch! Uh, I can't see. Windstorm, don't slow down, please. They mustn't get you. Whatever you do, don't 
Shit! Five O! Please. Don't be scared, warrior. <sighs> Actual maker. We are by your side. We will protect you. And I have a bow now. Someone's getting shot. How? Not this guy, he seems fine. Although he allegedly is on board with the fire training evil shit. Uh, there she is. Hello, Ari. Did you sleep well? Where is Windstorm? Is he fine? Where am I? Windstorm is okay. You're at the northern hills. You passed out, but Windstorm has taken good care of you. I was knocked out by some branches. I tried to protect Windstorm, and we had to ride through the woods. Mm-hmm. You're quite stubborn, just like him. No wonder you don't have a lump. You stirred up a lot of trouble. Even the police are looking for you. The police? But I'm on two stars! Thorder and Isabel tried to hurt Windstorm. I had to do something. I only tried to help him because they used fire to scare him. You have to believe me. You have to calm down, Ari. They don't let your anger overwhelm you. Running off with Windstorm is not the answer. I believe that it is absolutely wrong to hurt horses, and those kinds of methods are no longer welcome at the ranch. What would be the best for Windstorm? The best thing for horse and rider is a strong bond. A friendship! Buddy! Quite right. But you cannot force a friendship. You have to work hard to get the trust of a horse. Pet ten animals. Some violence won't get you anywhere. What Windstorm needs is a strong bond. A dominant but trusted hand. Baldock, the warrior. Show me the way of the warrior, <laughs> please. Keep can I have a little montage, please? I can. And I will. It's the right thing to do. But first, we have to take a step back. We have to take care of Windstorm first. Only when he is in good shape can he unleash his full potential. Oh, sure. But there is no corral here. Just for him so that he can recover. Nice sentence. The ancient Mongols, the cowboys, or other nomads didn't have that luxury either. You can work with Windstorm anytime you want. This will strengthen his trust and your bond. When you are at a campsite like this, he will be even more relaxed. Are you sure? He seems so distant. I even think that he doesn't want to be touched by me. That's a lot of hot air balloons. Is there an event on? Yesterday's excitement took its toll. Your friendship with Windstorm is only at the beginning and still rather fragile. Remember, it takes time and effort to strengthen that bond. Only mutual training and working together will get you closer to that goal. Well, enough for now. I put a few markers up on the hill. Take Windstorm and follow the markers, and then come back. Okay, any reason for that? Just Oh, nice. Missed him for a horse. It's a good I mean, he's right there, and I'm going to pet him again. Just, uh, so that's me. That's my campfire. But all these things are going to be plot relevant, right? Oh, I remember the airfield from the last one, actually. Being excited, you know, when I decided I was done with that, I think I did have a bit of explore. I was like, let's check out the airfield. It was alright, I couldn't steal a plane. And a few nice little question marks. It is a fair question, Ray, as to why it would be hard for the police to 
track down this child and horse. But I feel like Khan's on my side a bit and possibly covering for me. And maybe the police are incompetent and or busy. I feel like a missing child should be fairly high priority. Even if they don't care about the horse. I'm not really sure what my context of the reason for doing this is. That's a nice bridge. Uh, let's see... No, Windstorm won't do that uh, jump. That's a terrible idea. Fair enough. Wouldn't sit well with me being the good guy. I'm gonna do a jump! It was wonderful! Well done, jump. That's that's cool too. Whoop. It's quite bad horsing, but yeah, I'm under no time pressure here. It's pretty nice water. Didn't have time to admire it before while I was on the run. Yeah, I like it. Oh, I guess I'm going there now. Oh, that's flowers. I thought that was a big old mound of shit. That's still to come. Another great jump from me. Yeah. Good timing. Wonderful. Okay, this mission is quite boring. And I, I never like having something like this where you've got no indication of how much more there is. Like, this could just go on forever. And I suppose it'll lead me back to the campfire. That'll be my clue that I'm getting near the end. But clearly that is not currently the case. I just went past it again. Oh, this is even further away. I hate this route. Oh, was I meant to turn there? Oh, there is a reverse button. I swear I tried that before. Back it up. Oh yeah, and I was meant to turn there. Ah, oh, no special credit this time. Oh, it's got an achievement. I wonder what that was for. Just doing lots of really sick jumps, I guess. Okay, this is probably it now. Probably heading back. Look, you can see it there. Yeah. Okay, I did that boring wandering. Do I get rewarded? And here they are again. Did you enjoy my little track? Nope. Yes, that was cool. Okay, I mean yes, but my I bad. I really had to concentrate to make it over the obstacles on the way. I'm exhausted. Over time, you won't even think about it. You'll just do it. And the stronger your bond of friendship grows, the more you can achieve together. I don't want to hurt him. I think that the jumping scares him. Now don't worry, Windstorm is a special horse. And jumping is a part of it. His great-grandmother was a very talented jumper. She was called the Amazing Mare. Amazing Mare? Yes, she carried a former Olympic rider around the course when he lost consciousness. Just like your escape yesterday, and Mika. Mika? Actual Mika. Hmm, you could say that he belongs to her. But she wouldn't like that. 
Mika, thinking about her, it gives me a headache. I dreamed about her again. Your head uh, might not be as hard as I thought. Last night seems to have worn you out. You need some sleep. Um, yes. But there is no bed here anywhere. Who needs a bed when nature itself can be your bedroom? Mm. Look around. Me. There are more campsites. I would like still like one. to have a bed. Storm and you can rest. And rest you should. You look like you've seen a ghost. I have prepared a campsite not far from here at an old castle. Why don't you ride there and I will check on you in the morning. You will be here in the morning? Yes, don't worry. I will look in on you. And tomorrow we will continue the training. Go on now. Go and search for the campsite at the castle. Uh Oh no, it's so I'm gonna stop uh, for the night now. I'm surprised it's got no save game option. It's presumably just auto saving. Uh and then I just quit and it's fine. But when I quit, am I even... And it's not going to say you three want to save because there won't be an option. So at least I won't get stuck in that loop. But I'm going to be very uncomfortable. Unless it does that last save um, timer thing, which is why my favourite way of games handling this. Auto save with telling you when the auto save was. Um, anyway. Um, pretty promising, right? Like, I am enjoying that it's quite relaxed and easy and I don't have to think and make notes. That's come true. Lots of plot for everyone. Um... I think some of the horse bits might get a bit dragged out once it gets going, lots of just running around in circles. Um, but then at some point we get this bow and arrow to look forward to and finding a tenth thing to pet. So um, just watching. I hope you've also enjoyed it and um, I'll see you next week. Good night.